Hello friends, this is Dr. Sushant Bhanja, your super specialty faculty of Atoms Learning. With me, Dr. Anuj Gupta, who secured AML rank 12 in INISS Neontology, October 2024. Congratulations, Dr. Anuj, for your fantastic rank. Good evening, sir, and thank yeah. you so much, sir. Thank you. Yeah. Tell me something about yourself. Uh, hi, uh, I'm Dr. Anuj Gupta. I'm basically from uh, the city of Jammu, Jammu and Kashmir. Good, good. And I did my MBBS from ASCOM's uh, Jammu and then did my MD uh, from GMC Jammu. And currently I'm doing my SRship also from ASCOM's Jammu only. Okay, okay, good. So uh, please uh, share your exam experience this time, this INISS. Uh, sir, uh, this was my second attempt of INISS yeah. uh, neurology. Uh, compared to the last time, the April one, I found the exam a bit tougher, especially because uh, the neurotology part, what I think was a bit less and the general part was more. Yes, yes. General part. So the proportion which we used to see that 70, 75% and 30, 20, 25% of general, I think the general was around 35, 40% and yeah. there was the less of uh, neurotology as compared to the previous INISS. Okay, previously so, it was uh, like 60, 40 ratio. 60. Yes. Like, I think I think that the general part especially was more and it yeah. was a bit tough also compared tough. to the previous one. More of the clinical oriented questions. Yes, yes, sir. yes. And sir. some image based questions also. Yes, sir. Many, many image based. Sir. So actually when uh, did you uh, start it, uh, start your preparation? Uh, sir, uh, uh, truthfully speaking that I didn't get any time during my MD residency period. Uh, I thought of doing neurotology when once I got my thesis topic also in neurotology only. So I just thought that after doing my residency that I'll be doing I will be preparing for uh, neurotology. So yeah. then I went to Dehradun after completing my residency there was, I was doing my assessment. And uh, before uh, the April one this year, I took off from the residency in the February and then prepared two months before that exam. And in the previous INISS, I got a rank of uh, 15. Yes. 15, but there were only nine seats that time. Got it. Got it. And, and then you called me that uh, I, I want neurotology only. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. so in this time, this time also, I when I came back to Jammu and uh, I again one month, two months, it took me time because it was taking time for the counseling in the previous INSS. Then again, I joined the residency back here. Yeah, yeah. I found Jammu. Then uh, before the exam, 20 days before, I took the leaves and prepared. Yes, yeah. I think two, three months are. Uh, Good enough for preparing. Uh, just one question: Which book would you suggest to your uh, juniors? Sir, uh, if we if we are focusing especially for the INISS part yes. and uh, subspecialties sub neonatology, mm. and uh, uh, only two books I think are sufficient enough: Ames NICU Protocols, the latest edition which has uh, three parts, and uh, some chapters from Klohati. Though the three New books have Klohati. offered. Yes, yes. So there are three books, New Cloity, New Ems Protocol, and New Nelson also. Also, sir. The yes. neonatology part. Yes, sir. The neonatology part. Yeah, I have read that from uh, Nelson also, the neonatology part. But uh, these three books are the line to line. You have to read everything from the Ems Nico Protocol. You can't miss any any of the line because questions are usually asked from that only. And also, the uh, you have to solve these previous year questions. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I remember the live classes you were taking just before the exam. Also, one question was, I think that it was the first question of uh, neurotology this time, that which, which one is not an association in the neural defect. You were teaching the renal part, the cardiac part. It was a straight question. Straight question, yeah. 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 Straight question. And it was the first question of neurotology, INISS. <laughs> Good. Yes, yes. And it was difficult one. This question uh, difficult one also. Yes, this paper was a bit tougher. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, this time. Sir. What is your advice to your juniors? Uh, uh, just pass the MD, you just uh, give some advice to your juniors. So, uh, first thing I'll tell them not to rush. Yes. First, decide that uh, really they want to go into a specialty. If they are interested, then then INISS is the best thing. If you yeah. are pre-planned, you, you know that you have to do a specialty you like, then I think INISS is the best shot for that. Okay. And, uh, for that, uh, three months, uh, to three to four months are sufficient enough and 
and, and it depends upon individual to individual either you can work also during the preparation i yes. might don't i can't do work also and read also at the same time so i used to take one month off before the exam so it's up to you but i think 3 months and 4 months 3 to 4 months of revision, revision is must so last yes, two, yes, something yes. very important last yes one. yes sir. yes sir. in the last month i think five to six times i have read the instruction protocol correct correct yeah, yeah. so mm, yeah. what was the strategy to uh, means uh, for the use of my uh, the app that atom zone so app uh, the live classes which you uh, which you took sir uh, during uh, sometimes i didn't do time because i was doing my residency also so i used to uh, watch it in 1.5x so that i could uh, get more time so after watching the videos i used to solve the q bank q bank and the q bank uh, what is the importance of live class that is the one to one interaction is there no? yes sir yes sir that is most important because uh, during solving the questions a yes. lot of uh, means doubts is there doubt clearance yes sir that's yes. one to one that gets a very much very advantage of that also the live classes also okay do I, do you want to dedicate someone yeah <laughs> this is there are a lot of people uh, <laughs> i can't name every one of them but firstly i'll thank the almighty god and my heavenly grandparents my parents mother father my wife who is also a gynecologist she is doing a senior residency here she has been very cooperative with me and and like we say that behind every successful man there is a woman and i think that's my wife and my mother and my sisters my family friends and my teachers especially you sir thank you so much <laughs> thank you i i think i have called you many times 10 15 times <laughs> after <laughs> the exam also and this time also i called you after the exam in chandigarh only yes. that the paper was very much difficult and it was mostly of the general and i don't know that i will get through or not and my teachers especially my head of department from uh, uh, gmc jammu dr gs seni sir my head of department in scoms jammu dr vinder sir and my head of department in dehradun also who is a pioneer in neonatology dr girish gupta sir okay okay yeah, yeah. what is your plan now means uh, then uh, oh, where to uh, take this uh, seats and uh, there is i think 16 seats there. so this time there are 19 seats 19 seats and my rank is 12 so i have selected a order so i'll be waiting waiting for that i have to decide with my seniors also i'll discuss with my seniors also and uh, then i'll see sir one thing i can uh, tell the juniors that uh, one year back uh, dr anush told sir mujhe neonatology karna hai <laughs> so, <laughs> yes so, this is the result after one year yes sir yes sir yes sir okay one second congratulations dr anush thank you so much sir thank you thank you thank you a lot and namaste namaste sir